Uh, good afternoon. I think I'm sitting wrong. There, I'm in the light. But anyway, I'm having lunch with my friend Vita, and she has something to say, so I'm going to put the camera right somewhere. On your seat. Do I have it on your seat? It's the white thing, is it showing up? Oh. Uh, who knows? Everybody knows I can't record. I'm so good at this. There we go. So when she comes and sits down, she has something to tell you that's very important about women's rights. And women have rights, hopefully, around the world. And if they don't, we need to fight for them. You know, women are the backbone of a country. We <laughs> are the birthing people, not the men. And we are strong women. So this is my friend Vida, and she hello has, there. She has a message. Can you see? This? I am um, pleading with. Uh, can you public, see I can see myself. Is that it? Yeah. This is not my name is Vida. I'm a mother of a soldier. And for that reason, I've been following him in the Sixth War, into the Islamic regime war. And at the end, nothing was done. Our soldier came home without any effective tools or remedy against Islamic regime. Islamic regime has moved into the United States and other countries by showing of many mosques established by a foreign government. We're now in Florida and there we thought that they cannot um, survive in a warm environment because uh, you know they have to cover all the time. But that's not so. These women suffer under the cover even if it's hot. Uh, we have established a rule of law that we'd like to pass, and that is reform mosque. We believe that this degradation against women starts at the core of every mosque who is implementing covering a, a female child. We're saying that this act is a religiosity abuse, and it's not a religion at work that we are trying to change. It is a change against the abuse of every child. There is uh, honor killing. In the United States, of all things. So this evil, and I think it's the most evil thing that could happen in the United States, and it's happening, and if we are not aware of it. If when you see a child with a covered hair coming out of your one of your school, believe that there are thousands of men who would kill you for no reason at all, just because you're not covering your hair. So be aware of it. When we pr produce this law, please vote for it. Reform every mosque for the reasons of the child abuse, spousal abuse, polygamy, and incest. Hallelujah. Tra we ask for Christ first. Child tra trafficking, because didn't you say nine-year-olds yes, are forced uh, to marry? The reason we say these mullahs in the mosque are um, uh, sexual predators is uh, by their hands, these little girls are sent around the uh, world by just over their heads saying a surah or a prayer and they are married to whoever by the consent of their parents because the parents are in in this also. This is the only crime that the parents have a lot to do with it. The honor killing is happened by the own parents, both parents. Exactly what is honor killing? Honor killing that you choose to kill your child because they're not following the rule of Islam that is not Islam. Islam been hijacked because Islam itself says hijab ruhana means cover your soul. Hijab ruhana. Ruhana means your soul, not cover your hair. But the Islamic regime says because you are your curvature, it's exciting to me and it could make me uh, uh, do sin, you have to be covered. This is the logic behind them. But what it is, is they, these mullahs commit most of the crime. These uh, mullahs uh, are married to many, many women and many, many children. And these children are born into the cult, believing that the God told you to cover your hair. And that's not, God never tells you to cover your hair. So hallelujah, we ask 
but first of all, Christ Almighty to help us in this endeavor, to pass this law that says reform mosque against the child abuse, the spousal okay, why abuse. Don't, why don't we say a little prayer yes, about my this? Yes, you, you, you pray. Dear Father in heaven, we ask you to bless the whole world and protect every woman from, from the, the sin of man. And uh, we will stand unified in our rights to be a woman. And we ask you to bless every woman who has already reached harm and to heal her soul, her heart, and her body. And I say these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Okay. Well, we'll come to my home. Let's have food for you. Okay. <laughs> so that is another day in my life. Please right. share, like, and subscribe. And let's see what I get into tomorrow. Love you. And God bless you.